Good morning. Welcome back to the Real Trigo channel. I am just moving my car down to my house because all my kit's in my shed. So I uh, had to just store it there temporarily this morning. Um, yeah, gonna load up the car and uh, head off to work. So in a bit of a rush this morning, so I have uh, not even got my chainsaw trousers on just yet, but let's get to it. Right, I shall uh, get on the road and see you at the yard, or at the job site. All right, today's job, quite a sprawling canopy on this oak tree, but it's actually pretty small, so I'm gonna get up there a few meters off the top, just really to tidy the shade, because it's not very good depiction of it this side. But just track that in the uh, lawn out, because it's very soggy. You can see wet grass here, so we don't want to damage anything, we don't need to. So get some height out, tuck in the sides selectively pruning a few branches and uh, should look quite nice. No, but it's not, not much to be cut. We do have to obviously avoid all the flowers. So there, the only bad thing is that big limb at the back snapped up. We're going to have to take it off. We're going to have to take it off. stay healthy which is just not going to happen if it if it gets battered by six meters I was thinking the other day I haven't done a fucking big reduction in ages Tree yesterday, uh, no Saturday, and it was so dead that it dried and split in half. Yeah, the squirrels taken all the bark away, and the tree had died last week or something. Just typical, typical customer. Lovely, lovely people. It's all the wood, yeah, all the wood. So it's looks quite nice job, but it wasn't too bad. The tree wasn't going to like fall in half, but I couldn't. I couldn't um, like spike into anything because of how absolutely knackered this tree was. But it was so dry, my spikes just did not go in. But no, they literally just kind of balanced on the outside. It was horrid. I'm there like trying to get as high as I can with cars all around it. And I'm just having to like lightly graze my spikes against the earth. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I do go and take a look at his trees for him sometimes just to give him a bit of confidence. I don't believe so. No, I don't think so. But as long as I've known him, he's used Stubby to do the climbing work. He's, had, he's got a young lad who does a bit.
That big bit over there, so that one you're going into now will just prune in and then you've got that big one. second portion of the day is just cutting back that from the pavement and then tidying it up and we got a little bit out of the back but I'll show you that after. Yeah. And we're done. Pretty decent day in the end. Pretty decent oak tree but didn't need much doing to it so weren't too bad of a climb um hopefully the it looked come up looking quite nice actually so hopefully the after photo or video came out and showed that but pretty good start to the week spent the afternoon just sorting out kit greasing changing chipper blades and 
um, fixing up stuff that needs to be maintained for the rest of the week. So off to a good start. Um, just going to head home now, get editing and finish my evening. So hopefully you've all enjoyed. Hopefully everybody's having a good start to their week. And uh, that's it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I shall see you in the morning.